while thinking about what we were gonna do on the walls, learned that Ozone House is doing a huge drive for backpacks um, and other school supplies. We often do these collaborative drawings, painting, um, kind of like a chess match back and forth and doing big abstract pieces. So we definitely wanted to bring that element into the, the walls, but could we do that on something that could eventually be passed on instead of just white walls over? And sometimes when you say like public art, open-ended, then everybody goes at it with their own angle and it just becomes like a mess. And so with this, uh, we have some general suggestions and some general ideas, but also even our targets are gonna be modified based on how the public plays off that. So I think that's, it's going to be the fun part is how they're going to affect the direction of the project. So hopefully we can bring creativity and, and kind of inspire people to do something they wouldn't normally have the courage to do. We started by drawing on napkins, hanging out, you know, we before we were dating. It was something we did, we just passed things back and forth, passed drawings back and forth. We have really different styles. Um, I am really fast and gestural, and in about 10 minutes I never want to see it again. And then Trevor will take that piece and tinker with it until the end of time, which is great and a good balance, um, but also comes with a lot of negotiation negotiations kind of thought about our work as couples therapy you know where we need to um, negotiate and learn how to take our really different styles and merge it into one piece